Hello and welcome back, my friends. We are going to do this again. We have another easy answer, random order, 2008 version video of the U.S. Civics Citizenship Test. These are the 100 official civics questions, the 2008 version from USCIS. Remember, you will be asked 10 randomly chosen questions. You must get six of those 10 correct in order to pass. Please know also that this is an oral test. There's no multiple choice, okay? You must say the answers out loud after the officer asks the question. Remember also, you need to only provide one answer unless the question specifically asks for more than one. That's a very common question we get here, so I hope to clarify that. And, well, let's get started with... Hmm, what major event happened on September 11th, 2001 in the United States? What major event happened on September 11th, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Terrorists attacked the United States. What is the capital of the United States? What is the capital of the United States? That's Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. The Bill of Rights. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. Fought for civil rights. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. The Civil War. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Who signs bills to become laws? Who signs bills to become laws? The President. The President. What does the Judicial Branch do? What does the Judicial Branch do? The judicial branch, it reviews laws, reviews laws. When do we celebrate Independence Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th, July 4th. How many U.S. Senators are there? How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. There are 100 U.S. Senators. 100. Why did the colonists fight the British? Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. Because of high taxes. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older, 18 and older. What did the Declaration of Independence do? What did the Declaration of Independence do? Said that the United States is free. Said that the United States is free. You can add in from Great Britain. Said the United States is free from Great Britain. Or just said the United States is free. 
We elect a U.S. senator for how many years? We elect a U.S. senator for how many years? Six. Six years. Senator six. Remember those S's. Okay. Six years for a senator. What does the Constitution do? What does the Constitution do? It sets up the government. Sets up the government. What are the two major political parties in the United States? What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Democratic and Republican. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? On the east coast, we have the Atlantic, the Atlantic Ocean, Atlantic. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. World War II. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson, or just Jefferson. Thomas Jefferson. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th, April 15th. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Crow, Crow. Who is the father of our country? Who is the father of our country? George Washington, or just Washington. Washington. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. To print money. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. The Missouri River. Missouri River. Okay, and there are two, the Missouri River or the Mississippi River. And some people have told me they prefer to say Mississippi. So, but either one is correct, Missouri or Mississippi. What is the highest court in the United States? What is the highest court in the United States? That would be the Supreme Court, the Supreme Court. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Because of the state's population. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4th, 1776. July 4th, 1776. Name one state that borders Mexico. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. California. What is one reason colonists came to America? What is one reason colonists came to America? For freedom. 
Freedom. What is the name of the national anthem? What is the name of the national anthem? That is the Star Spangled Banner. <laughs> Try it again. The Star Spangled Banner. Hmm. What is the supreme law of the land? What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. The Constitution. What is the political party of the president now? What is the political party of the president now? Democratic Party. The Democratic Party. When must all men register for the selective service? When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. At age 18. Who was president during World War I? Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson or just Wilson? Okay, that's an easy one to remember. We have World War I Woodrow Wilson, right? Okay. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Slavery. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. All people of the state. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? That is Kamala Harris, or just Harris. Harris. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Checks and balances. Name your U.S. representative. Name your U.S. representative. Answers, of course, here will vary. You can go to house.gov and type in your zip code and your address to find the name of your specific U.S. representative. What is freedom of religion? What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. In what month do we vote for president? In what month do we vote for president? November. November. We elect a president for how many years? We elect a president for how many years? Four years. Four. Four years. Name one branch or part of the government. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. Congress. What are two cabinet level positions? What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. Who is the commander in chief of the military? Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president, the president. Name two national U.S. holidays. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day, 
President's Day, New Year's Day, and President's Day. How many amendments does the Constitution have? How many amendments does the Constitution have? 27, 27 amendments, 27. Where is the Statue of Liberty? Where is the Statue of Liberty? That's in New York, New York. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans, Africans. Who vetoes bills? Who vetoes bills? The president, the president. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and the House. The Senate and House. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. The Speaker of the House. What is the name of the president of the United States now? What is the name of the president of the United States now? Joe Biden, Joe Biden, or just Biden. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Chief Justice is John Roberts, John Roberts. Who is the governor of your state now? Who is the governor of your state now? Answers, of course, here will vary. You can go to usa.gov slash state dash governor to choose your state to find the name of your governor. Okay. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president, the vice president. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life and liberty. Life and liberty. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers again here will vary depending where you live. To find your senators, go to senate.gov to choose your state to show your senators. Every state has two senators and you just choose either name, whichever name you can remember best. What is the rule of law? What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Everyone must follow the law. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Freed the slaves. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? To obey the laws of the United States. To obey the laws of the United States. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435, 435. 
During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Communism. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. Louisiana. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Nine justices. What did Susan B. Anthony do? What did Susan B. Anthony do? She fought for civil rights. She fought for civil rights. Another answer here, some people say, is fought for women's rights. So either, either one is correct, fought for civil rights or fought for women's rights. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. John Jay, or just Jay? Jay. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Because there were 13 original colonies. What does the president's cabinet do? What does the president's cabinet do? Advises the president. Advises the president. Name one U.S. territory. Name one U.S. territory. Okay. Here I chose... Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico. Another easy one, um, maybe easier to say, is Guam, Guam. Okay. So any of the answers are okay. Just one, though. Who was the first president? Who was the first president? George Washington, or just Washington. Washington. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. Two years. So just quick review. U.S. representative, two years. A senator, six years. And the president, four years. Okay. Some people confuse those three questions. All right, U.S. Representative, two years. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War II. World War II. Name one right only for United States citizens. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Vote in a federal election. What is the capital of your state? What is the capital of your state? Of course, answers here will vary depending where you live. Please find the capital of your state. And if you can't, let us know and we will find it for you. If you live in D.C., you can say that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. What is an amendment? What is an amendment? An amendment is a change to the Constitution. A change. Okay. So you can say a change to the Constitution 
or just a change, a change. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. We the people. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. Because there are 50 states. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Vote in a federal election. Vote in a federal election. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Roosevelt. Franklin Roosevelt. Or just Roosevelt. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Speech. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. The civil rights movement. Or just civil rights. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. The United States. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. Freed the slaves. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. American Indians. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? Was a U.S. diplomat. U.S. diplomat. Who makes federal laws? Who makes federal laws? Congress. Congress. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. Citizens 18 and older can vote. There were 13 original states. Name three. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. The Civil War. What is the economic system in the United States? What is the economic system in the United States? It is a 
capitalist economy. Capitalist economy. If you have a difficult time pronouncing capitalist, you can also say market. Market economy. Either answer is correct. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote and join a political party. Vote and join a political party. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. To provide schooling and education. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Okay, the west coast has the Pacific, the Pacific Ocean. Who is in charge of the executive branch? Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president, the president. Name one state that borders Canada. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. New York. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech, freedom of religion. Freedom of speech, freedom of religion. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The Constitution was written. When was the Constitution written? When was the Constitution written? In 1787. 1787. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Who did the United States fight in World War II? That's Japan, Germany, and Italy. Okay, and please say all three countries. Japan, Germany, and Italy. And there we have it. Wow, we did it again, my friends. All 100 civics questions. I need a drink. Thank you for joining me today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Your subscriptions help our channel a lot. And we totally appreciate your support. Please leave questions and comments below and we will do what we can to help you find the answers you need. Thanks again for watching and have a wonderful day. Oh wait, please remember the civics questions are only one part of the entire N400 interview. Please remember to also review your N400 application before attending the interview. Okay, questions? Ask below. All right. Have a great day. Bye-bye.